LC, right? Pardon me? LC, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, walk us through what the season uh, meant to you and uh, meant to this group here with uh, what you built in season two here. Um, yeah, I mean, it was just a lot of fun. We had a great group. Um, it was fun kind of just early realizing that we, we had a good group and obviously, you know, just a stronger team than last year. So it was obviously, um, I think, a little bit sweeter, just kind of how rough our year last year was um, to kind of give, uh, give this city a playoff run. It was awesome. You were here since the beginning. Can you talk about how you saw the community kind of swell behind you and how this year maybe was different from last year? Yeah, I mean, it was huge last year too. Right away, you could feel the support, and just like I said, obviously we didn't give them the best show last year. So um, once we started winning stuff, it just kept growing and growing. And then obviously in playoffs, the fans, the community, just kind of seeing cracking logos everywhere was awesome. Was there any instance that like kind of shocked you where you were like, oh, I can't believe I'm seeing cracking stuff there, or a fan approached you, or anything like that? Um, you started to see it more out in Bellevue too. Like last year, you kind of see it all downtown. Um, even this year was more downtown for sure, but then he started seeing it come out in Bellevue and, you know, the bumper stickers and then just logos and all the bars and stuff, so it was cool. You have a uh, big summer ahead here. Any idea what the future is going to hold here in the interim? Is it still too early, too early right now? Yeah, I think just a little too early. I mean, there's obviously a lot that goes into it, especially with this team, kind of just some injuries and um, just kind of seeing where they're going forward. So um, just kind of let the dust settle, let Ron kind of see where this team's going, and then... Um, communication will start. Carson, what is your process for the offseason? How much do you like to step away from the game? Will you watch the playoffs when you start training? Yeah, I'll definitely catch the playoffs. Um, you know, a couple games on, especially back home, people are always watching the playoffs. So, um, But I'll definitely take a couple weeks away from just working out and then kind of ease back into it and then stay off the ice for a month or so. A lot of great moments this season for the whole team. I mean, is the one that kind of stands out to you as like a highlight of the year? Um. There's obviously a lot of great regular season, um, but then you get in the playoffs and they don't compare. I think winning that game seven was was the top, obviously, just kind of moving to the next round and saying, just realizing that we have another chance at, you know, advancing another series. So it's it's hard to beat that, but there was a lot of great regular season ones too. One any, more. any compliments around the mustache so far? Uh, I don't know if there's so much compliments or just, oh, you're going with the mustache. I don't know if it's good things or bad things, but... People notice it. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, Will Morgan's a guy you know pretty well. You played with him a, a good amount in the beginning of the season. What did you see from him through the course of the year? I know he didn't play a lot last year and played some meaningful minutes this year. What did you see out of his game? Yeah, I think it's just a confidence thing. Um, once he starts to get those regular minutes, um, it's it's a big confidence boost, and then you get the sh the support of the coach. Um, Obviously, and then he just he just played his game. I mean, he's obviously such a good straight skater. He's strong. He defends well. Um, that was kind of what everyone saw. And then once I said the confidence comes, then he started to see the puck handling, how well he moves the puck too, and how well he can skate with it. So um, it's awesome to see him grow like that. What did it take away about your game this year? Um, yeah, I wouldn't say it was my best year, I guess, offensively. But I'm still growing in in the fact of consistency every night. Um, and then obviously I was just happy with the playoffs kind of, you know, just when the intensity rose, I think a lot of our team, um, and I thought I was one of them who kind of just stepped up their game. And um, I think that's kind of why we advanced one series and almost another. I know it's early with the contract stuff, but has Will been lobbying you to stay? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's a business. So obviously I'd want to stay and hang out. I love this group. Um, we've battled for two years together and we kind of, you know, we're growing some here. So obviously I'd love to stay. Um, I don't know if he's lobbying for me yet or if he'd say that, but hopefully he wants me to stay. Have you seen the young Fergus kid this summer and help him a lot, or how will that work? Yeah, we'll, we'll have a brief summer um, back home just because uh, my wife's expecting, so we're kind of going to the wherever city or hopefully back in Seattle early July, so we won't be with them too much, but I'll be with them for a month or so, yeah. Hopefully I'll just be telling them um get his food in uh, put on some weight and obviously just kind of keep growing with his game he's still young he's got some time um he's obviously a really special player like i said he puts on some size he's gonna be a really good player All set. Yeah, thank you yeah thanks guys appreciate it